So this is the gorgeous Penny Ragdoll. And she's just arrived. She's a little bit shaky on the table coming in the car. So I've just had her in my arms, have a little cuddle. And I'm just putting the Zoom Groom over to calm her down. You can see what's come off her just with the Zoom Groom. So she's arrived today. She, oh yes, he's a good girl. She's arrived today for a bib trim. And the reason for the bib trim is because when she's eating and drinking, the bib is curling underneath her and she's eating half of it. So she's going to have that done. So I'm literally just going over her just to give her a little, little bit of a massage before we get started. But you can see what's come off her already. Her mum's just said she's melting like crazy. So I've just said about... Um, using the zoom groom on her and she said she's not that keen she doesn't oh, oh. Oh, it's because i'm talking back you come um so she she uses the comb she's gonna go again that's because her basket's on show i'll have to move her basket penny dog you have to move uh so i just said just um use the zoom groom on her she's not that fussed on it at home i just said just use it every single day <laughs> I'm just going to put that basket on the floor because that's a little escape route at the moment. Out of sight, out of mind, isn't it, Penny? Hey, yeah. Ah, now this the over the shoulders, Con instant relaxing. Head's heavy in my hands there. See what's coming off here. Good girly. Yes, we're going to give you a little bit trim, aren't we? Hey. Now she says, I don't mind you doing that at all. Look at those blue eyes. So if you like watching the channel and you like watching on Pussycats, you know what to do. You can like, share, subscribe. Helps the word get around the world about how important it is to groom our cats and to look after our pussy cats. Isn't it, Pen? You want to ask everybody? Say, everybody, hey, listen to me. We all need help with our coats, yeah. don't we? <laughs> You're a good girl. We need our mummies and daddies to help, don't we? Mm. So you just see what's coming off this little girl. Yes. You are molting, aren't you? I'm not surprised because we've had a bit of a heat wave, haven't we, in the UK? Penny? We're not used to these temperatures, are we? Good girly. So yeah, it's just as important to do down here as well on the flanks. Where the coat is very thick. And you can always just stand her up a little bit. <clears throat> just to get a little bit of a stretch down there. Oh gosh, Penny. Fluff everywhere. Good job I don't have cat allergies, isn't it? There's a lot coming out. Whew. It's all up my nose. Oh, oh Penny. I'm going to start sneezing in a minute. You're a good girl, eh? Yeah. Right, I think that's enough of that for now. Yeah, we 
do your bib. And you go, good girl. Woo. See you, me. So that's what she will be licking out of her coat herself. And that's what can cause the old fur balls. Some cats suffer with them more than others. That's a good girl. There's lots of floating wispy hair, isn't there, Steve? Mm -hmm. <laughs> All over the show. Right, so I'm just going to have a look and see what we're doing here with this bib. So she had a couple of big mats under here the last time she came. We had to clip them away and then do the bib trim. What I'm going to do, because she's got no mats, I've already checked her. I'm going to do just a shortening up all over there for her. So um, you'll have to stop filming for a minute, Steve, because I need yeah. to go get the comb for my clippers. I'm not ready. So we're back and ready to go. Got the comb on the clippers now. <coughs> Because we don't want a really short cut with the normal blade, so we put a comb over the top just to keep the length a little bit. We do a bit at a time and we take it down just a little bit and a little bit until we think it's short enough. Good girl. So the only problem with rag dolls, they do tend to collapse on you, which makes it difficult to do under the chin sometimes. Good girly. under that chinny. Okay. Good girl. So last time I couldn't shorten like I am at the moment because she had these pelts here so I had to take I shave them away. And then we left this a little bit longer to try and hide where we'd had to go close to the skin. So I've actually been able to take a little bit shorter today, which means it'll last a little bit longer as well. So I'm 
just going to get her to stand properly in a minute so I can just get a little bit lower between those front legs so she's not got loads of stuff sticking out. And these real wispy bits here, these just come out with your fingers. Got a few little wayward ones there, haven't you? Hey, good girl, Pen. You good girl. stretch on it just gets the clippers working a little bit better there we go good girl good girl good girl very good Good girl. I think that's all pretty done. Isn't it, hey? Just got to do your claws. Hey. Yep. Happy with that. Good girl, eh? Pen. We'll finish with your paws, don't we? And just do a little bit of this. This is what tidies them up, all this wispy, just with your fingers. This is all this very fine stuff. It was going up my nose, Penny, wasn't it, when we were Zoom grooming? And that's what the Zoom groom can grab, you see, which is brilliant. I'm just going to do a little bit of... It's not too bad on this side. She's not as, as got as much wispy on this side. Only a little bit, really. Girl Penny. Just tidies that line up. And you can do that everywhere, all around the bum area as well. If they're a little bit wispy down here, you can do some little pulls there. You're only grabbing the very end. I don't even know if she can feel it. Ooh. Come off that pen. There you go. So I'm just going to finish on a bit of a zoom groom. Do a tootsies. And she's going to be all finished, aren't you? So let me just get my glasses on. Let me have a little look at these tootsies. So I normally always do claws first, but I know how good she is. So you always handle your cats as much as possible. So foot in your hand and you're just pushing those toes out to get that claw to come out and away from the path. Good girl. Good girl. And don't forget the dew claw. Are you a good girl? He said, What are you doing to me, Andinita? Hmm? Have this 
one, man. This is always the awkward one, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Always the awkward one. Yeah, let me get this one here. Okay. Okay, Papa. Come that way. There you go. Good girl. There's two. you clue to do? Oh, that's quite short, that one. Five. Good girlie. What a star pupil. Hey. What a star pupil, Penny. Hey. Yeah. There you go. She said, where am I going? She said, I've just spotted my basket on the floor. <laughs> Come this side for me. Let me just see if I can do these back tootsies. And the back aren't as long as the front, obviously, because they're carrying more weight at the back. She doesn't need much off those at all. That's one leg done. Is this leggy? Let's go that way. Let's go that way. Good girl. We see this summit. Very little needed off here. Good girl. That's all Tootsie's done. There you go. What a girl. <laughs> she says, my basket's yeah. there. <laughs> oh, Penny, good girl. Yes, you're a good girl. There we go. Not a bad face. Cutie booty. Full weight in my hands. What a cutie booty. <laughs> what are you doing?